This morning, uh, we reported 126 new cases of COVID-19 in the district, bringing our total cases to 2,476. Uh, and sadly, we also announced five deaths, bringing um, the number of lives lost in Washington, D.C. to 86. We need to th be thinking about the capacity of our healthcare system to treat patients and to absorb spikes in COVID-19 cases. So today our team is doing a walkthrough of the convention center with the U.S. Army Corps of Engineers. They will begin set up this coming Monday. And by the first week of May, uh, we will have 500 beds set up for low acuity care. Uh, this means these beds will be for non-ICU patients uh, that do not require a ventilator. Uh, this for us uh, means uh, that we will be prepared for the worst case scenario, uh, but our goal is to never need to use the convention center. Uh, and so our message uh, is clear. Um, we continue to ask all residents to stay at home and only travel for essential um, business and activities. Continue to practice social distancing. Uh, and if you leave your house um, for essential activities, wear a face covering. 